What's up everybody? It's Ron Beckham. Welcome to the first unboxing, gaming unboxing. It's kind of something I want to do for those who don't know. I'm a huge gamer and um, I want to start hitting the gaming market a lot more and fan base and um, you know I'm starting to play fighting games professionally in Justice and um, for today we have Marvel vs. Capcom. The new one, Infinite, Infinity, whatever you want to call it. You can correct me. But we have the Collector's Edition. Uh, right here. Uh, 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 uh. Uh. Comes this nice black box. <sighs> nice big black box. The triple B, the BBB, right here. Looking nice. Actually, so I just went to GameStop. I actually purchased this. Did not get it for free. Um, went walked into GameStop after the gym session, and uh, somebody actually ended up not wanting theirs. Uh, they went, it came in, just bought a regular copy, didn't get the collector's edition. It runs two hundred seventeen dollars for this collector's edition. Um, so in the box, Captain Marvel, Iron Man, Chun Li, Mega Man X, and uh, you get the little Infinity Stone replicas here, which is cool. Uh, Let's see, let's see, let's see. What was I gonna say? All right, so, uh, one thing that I, I'm just going based off of this, but I'm seeing that the faces don't look as bad as actual in gameplay at E3. I played a little bit of the um, the demo and the beta or whatever, and uh, that's been kind of a huge epidemic with this game is that the faces of the characters are just so horribly done. In gameplay, you don't recognize it because there's too much shit going on and you're just, you're, just, you're just trying to beat the other player. But when it comes to story mode and cutscenes and you really give a, a, a look at, at the faces and you start getting detailed and you just make the most stankiest face like, like really? Really? It's 2017, really? We're having facial issue problems? And that's kind of how I feel, you know? And it's like, okay, maybe the gameplay stepped up, but like, I feel like the graphics took a step back, right? So. You know, enough of me complaining about that, but I think this is going to be really cool, so let's unbox it. Uh, what is this? So there's always handle figure and care, blah, 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 handling operations instructions. Okay, so it does take batteries, so they do light up. And as you see right here, it's the actual desk. I got it for PS4. Boom. Uh, this is it's a steel box, nice steel box in there, so I already feel that. Uh, let me check this out. Ooh. All right, unwrap that, blah, blah, blah. Let's take it out, nice clear case, cover. A little, kind of like, when I say clear, I mean like that, you know. Uh, of course, the back. Awesome steel cover. I love the steel, just the steel um, cases. I just, for any time I can get a steel case, it started with Call of Duty, and then it just continued on, because they just look so nice. Character pass, got that. Disc, of course, I got a PS4, as you can see. Uh, let's take this bad boy out. Ugh. Uh, all right. Let's see what. All right, I did not do that correctly. I did not do that correctly. I did not do that correctly either. But just want the finger these edges. Yeah. Who cares about this part, right? 15 hours later. So open this up from your side. All right, so maybe I should lay it down instead. Boom. Awesome. So each figure, good nice size. Really good nice size. These will fit around here perfectly. I'll take this out, Captain Marvel.
Okay, okay. I like it. Pretty nice detail figure. Uh, very, the quality of it feels really good. Goes along with my collection. I'll show you the collection in a minute. Over here, I like nice quality figures. And this fits in perfectly, all of these do. Nice. So there's one. Uh, Mega Man X, which is my favorite series of Mega Man, Mega Man X, when Zero comes in, and uh, what was it, uh, Al Axel, Zero and Axel come in, yeah, we all know Zero's cooler, but we got Mega Man here, so whatever, uh, like I said, nice quality all around, I'm guessing they stick together, uh, I don't, I wouldn't stick them together, I don't want that, I just kind of want everybody spread apart around scattered around the desk area and my collection area. Iron Man, of course, I've been needing the Iron Man figure, so this definitely fits in. Great, uh, good quality, good, nice detailed. So she right there, bro. And Chun Li, sexy Li. Fun fact, um, I just met one of the producers of Street Fighter in LA. Uh, I got his contact info and everything, so hopefully we might have some um, Tehran and some acting and stuff, because he's really trying to help me out. Him and his wife said they love me. His name is Barry uh, Levine, Levine, Barry Levine. He produced uh, Judge Dredd, Street Fighters, Hercules, um, um, what's that Tom Cruise movie, uh, Ob 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 Oblivion, Oblivion. And um, like I said, he said he really loved me, uh, my personality and stuff, and you know, I belong in the acting business. So hopefully that works out. But I say that because he's Street Fighter and Chun-Li, Street Fighter, of course. Them legs, these legs don't look as thick as they supposed to be, but you know what, we gon', we gon' just be all right with that. All right, her face looks all right, all right, we're good. Her face in the game to me was like, hers and Dante's was one of the worst ones in the game. But right here, it looks all right. So I'm, I'm cool with that. And then the gems, the infinity stones, coming in this box right here. Look at that. Some for Easter for you. And then the batteries, I guess. Did they give me batteries? Yo, if they didn't give me batteries, that's like messed up. Let me see. Hold on. Yo, that's booty, bro. That's booty. Oh, they got me batteries, though. They got me batteries. All right. But I gotta undo it, I ain't got a screw to undo this. But they do light up. So I think that'd be pretty cool just to kind of have on here, just to kind of be like extra, to have these lit up in my little lit light area in the house. But that is everything. I am about to put this in, download it, stream on Twitch. Uh, for, the, for those who don't know, I do stream on Twitch at twitch.com slash FB Aftermath live stream, usually around 10 o'clock at night. Um, so be there. Uh, I would love for all of you to be there to interact with me. I do giveaways and stuff. Once I reach 50 viewers, uh, I do giveaways. But it's a fun time. I'll be rapping and stuff. I'll be having a good time. And I'm actually a good gamer, for those who don't know. I'm a really good gamer. Especially at Injustice. Like, that's my game. Sub-Zero all day. But let's see what I can do doing some damage on Marvel vs. Capcom. Much love. A-Clan, out.